Welcome into PFF TV. I'm Sam Monson. He's Steve Palazzolo. And today, Steve, we're going to be diving into Ohio State's national title credentials. This video is brought to you by Eckrich, the official smoked sausage of the college football playoffs. And Steve, it's all about the passing game at any level, whether it's the NFL, whether it's college, whether it's high school, passing is king. Luckily for Ohio State, they've got their best quarterback to come along in a number of years. They really do, and when you look at Ohio State's offense, they've always done a nice job of running the ball, and in recent years, with JT Barrett at the helm, he could run the ball uh, at the quarterback position and throw the ball okay, but it's a completely different dynamic now. Ohio State truly does have their best quarterback in years, and that includes when Cardell Jones took over and they went on their national championship run, and it includes when JT Barrett was there these last couple of years. Dwayne Haskins brings a completely different dynamic to this offense because of his ability to drive the ball down the field, to make good decisions, to make tight window throws. We've seen three games of action now, so we're not overreacting, but I think we've seen enough from him that he is by far the most polished, most accurate passer Ohio State has had in a number of years. And those two guys are both grading pretty well for us. Both ended up in the NFL. That just tells you just how good Haskins has been to grade at another level above those guys entirely. But what about the defense, Steve? If there's a concern there, it's on the back end in coverage as well. It's their pass game defense. I'm going to go with a delicate touch over the treehouse, off the trampoline, through the target. Oh, boom, beat that. I'm about to. I'm going off the rebound net, off the porch column, straight through the target while I go down the slide. You got no shot. The Eckridge Million Dollar Challenge is back. Enter at EckridgeFootball.com for your chance to win. Where's the wind? Yeah, it's really howling out. Yeah, so it's all about stop the pass and pass the ball. So those two things have to work well together. So in the past, with Ohio State, they've just been churning through NFL caliber cornerbacks for Marshawn Lattimore, Malik Hooker at safety, Eli Apple at corner, Denzel Ward last year. And if you look at our historical coverage grades for Ohio State the last few years, they've been in the top 15 in three out of the last four years. But this year, and this is just out of Power 5 teams, they are, they are currently 41st in our coverage grades. So this is the worst coverage unit we've seen so far from Ohio State. They don't have a linebacker grading over an average 61.5 grade from a coverage standpoint. So their back seven is a concern. So as good as they are in the pass game with Haskins running the show and the playmakers he's throwing it to, I think they've got some concerns on the back end. So it's just a different looking Ohio State team this season. But something that's going to help that front end when it comes to the defense is their pass rush. And Nick Bosa is injured, but as we told you last week in our Ohio State video, that defensive pass rush is more than just Nick Bosa. They have a lot of horses up front that can mitigate some of the struggles on the back end in coverage. That's one of the biggest keys. Even without Bosa, you've got Chase Young up there. You've got Draymond Jones. Jones has our top pass rushing grade among all interior defensive players. When Bosa is healthy, he is our best pass rusher on the edge from a grading standpoint. And of course, Chase Young, who I just mentioned, he's ready to become a superstar. I mean, that's why uh, in our most recent video, we said, look, Ohio State has the best defensive line in the nation because of their high-end players. And also they've got the depth as well. So when it comes to Ohio State this season, it's all about the pass game, offensively and defensively. And they have to hope that the pass rush gets home just a little bit more this year to protect their back seven. This video has been brought to you by Eckridge. Don't forget to pick up your Eckridge smoked sausage at your local grocery store for this weekend's tailgate or home gate party. And make sure to visit EckridgeFootball.com for great game day recipes and to enter the season-long million dollar challenge.